This is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on how to read things later on your iPhone with Instapaper. Now, if you have an Instapaper account online, you can read your items on your iPhone. You can get the app from the App Store, just download that, put it on your iPhone, and then tap on the icon. You see your columns, the items that you've marked to read later, items that you've starred, and items that you've already read that are now in your archive. On the iPhone, it keeps the last 10 things that you've archived. Now, you can look at your read later items, pick an item to read. If you tap on edit, you get this screen. And then if you tap on the red minus sign, you can delete an item. We'll also delete it online. You can go into settings. You can change dark interface. You can change the font have rotation off or on, have it update automatically, have graphical pages or not. If you go down a little bit further, you can install Read Later in Safari, and then it shows your account information. And if you wish, you can clear and re-download articles or log out and clear articles. So, this is Instapaper for the iPhone, and that's all there is to it.